So it's four in the morning right now, y'all. As you see, I'm at the airport. You know what I'm saying? I got the kids with me this time. This is the kids' first time on the airplane. And we about to go to Orlando real quick. I'm exhausted. I got probably like two hours of sleep last night. Yesterday, I drove all the way to New York. Drove to Philly. Had to wake up early this morning, y'all. Are you excited about getting on the plane? It's your first time, right? What do you think is going to happen? Let me tell you what's going to happen. We're going to go to Orlando. I don't know what that is. I'm going to be honest with y'all. I got to take a shit right now. Like, my stomach is killing me. Like, you can always tell when it's going to be diarrhea, bro. Like, that food that I had like, yesterday in New York, bro, it got my stomach tore up right now. I'm just trying to hurry up and get on this flight. Although this airport's closer to me, I've never flown at this airport before. Like, I always fly out of Baltimore, dog. Like, which is crazy, because, like, a normal person would go to the closest one. And then I realized, bro, tickets at this one cheaper. Like, I've been paying all that, driving to Baltimore for no reason. You scared? You excited? I ain't realize they had family boarding, y'all. We boarded way earlier than we normally do, bro. Like, we sometimes be last getting on, bro. But look. When you got the kids with you, you first. Pick it up. Mike, gotta start bringing the kids more often. So Y'all see what's about to blow me is, I still gotta take a shit, bro. Like I wasn't able to get it done, you feel me? Like, this might be a messy one. All right, y'all, so we just landed in Orlando. How was the flight? You guys liked it? Yeah. You guys want to get on more? Yeah. yeah. See y'all. They adventurous. They ready for whatever. Damn y'all, I ain't gonna hold you. Hey, this motherfucker packed. Like compared to all the other airports I flew into, this is probably the deepest jump. Sheesh. Everybody in Orlando. I ain't gonna lie. I haven't been to Orlando since I was like a kid. And Orlando look like a vibe. I heard that nigga talk a super put him on the list. And I don't even know my shooter here in the Alright, y'all. So the first place I'm about to try is gonna be chicken fire while I'm out here. I've been wanting to try this place, bruh. Keith Lee ended up going trying it. He blew the spot up, bro. They probably gonna spit in my food now because they're gonna see me with the camera. They're gonna think I'm about to violate him and they're gonna violate me, bruh. Thanks a lot, Keith Lee. They're gonna violate me now. This has literally been on my Florida list, bro. Like, it keeps popping up on my FYP, and I seen Keith Lee win. He ain't like the food, bro. The blend of those spices is kind of off putting me. 3.5 out of 10. But I still gotta try it, bro. Still got to. Because that joint was looking righteous online. Have you been here before? Yeah, I've been here a couple times. Uh, this has been my third time here. Solid food, never been an issue. Usually it's more packed than this. We caught out the right day, but we're gonna tap in. It's gonna be good stuff. So I ain't gonna lie to y'all. This is a regular right here, and he's saying that the food is top tier. It's smelling good in here. I got the medium and I got the mild. They saying that it's super hot, y'all. We gonna find out real quick what's up with it. Bro, they seasoning the fries up. I'm watching them, bro. La, 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 la. The thing is, I'm excited about this right now. I know about all the controversy going on right now, bro. But the shit smelling good. I ain't gonna lie to y'all. I'm gonna keep it a band right now. Look, he fucking that shit up. That shit good, bro. <laughs> yeah, I'm not even gonna lie, bro. This shit got some random slave recipe they doing back there, bro. It's like a witchcraft. I'm not even gonna front shit. He... I ain't gonna lie. It looks slow in the jump, but shit. I mean, he he fucking it up. He said he a regular. <laughs> so y'all see, I got the chicken fire right here, bro. I'm gonna eat it while it's fresh. Eat it while it's hot. You feel me? I'm gonna pop it out right here, right now. Let's see what's up with the chicken fire real quick. So I ain't going to lie to y'all, bruh. Just looking at it straight up like this, bruh, it's looking top tier. Like, y'all see how the fries is looking? They seasoned up real nice. They kind of looking like them TikToks that they was posting, bro. Even the chicken. Look how seasoned the chicken is. You see it. Damn. Chicken is extremely crispy. Look, it look like Nashville chicken. The way it gets your hands all greasy and messy like that. But we're gonna start out with a fry. I'm gonna try it with and without the soy sauce. Fry's hot. Hot and crunchy. Soy sauce.
the soul sauce tastes like the raisin cane sauce. Looking at the sauce, it kind of looks like the raisin cane sauce a little bit. The fried seasoning is slightly sweet. It's not real sweet. It kind of reminds you of like, I want to say how Wingstop's fries are kind of sweet, but they're not super sweet, you know what I mean? They don't taste like Wingstop fries, but I'm just comparing it, like the sweetness level. But let's see what's up with the chicken strip. You see it. As y'all see, the chicken tender is huge. Extremely big chicken tender. Greasy. You see it's dripping. Let's see what it's tasting like. Dipping in a little bit of this soy sauce. It's not juicy. Juicy and spicy. Oh, uh. Put a little bit of this sauce back up on that bit. Mm. This don't buy. Like, I got the medium. And they say that the medium is extremely hot. So if you go hotter than that, they say that you're not even going to be able to enjoy it. And I can honestly say, he was right about it because the medium is hot as hell. They did season it up real nice. You know what I'm saying? Seasoned up extremely nice. It's not your average chicken center. This ain't that Tyson's box shit. You see how thick it is. Extremely girthy piece of chicken. Extremely girthy. Season up to perfection. Got a nice crisp to it. When you bite, juice exploding in your mouth. Pause. Comes with a little bit of pickles. Yeah. I can do it without the pickles. But I'm gonna be honest with y'all, bro. Like, the tenders is pretty good. Tenders hit. I don't know if they just seen it was me, and they add a little bit of extra um, shit to this, but it's hit. I got, I got a question for you. Have you had this before? No, this is my first time. Your first time, man. It, it's hitting, bro. I, I just came because I saw Keith on uh, TikTok. Yeah. Know? So I was just coming to see it for myself. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You got to let me know what you think when you come out, man. Hey, Keith Lee hooking him up. He getting them business. He getting them business. Mm. They going to come back after eating this shit. I ain't going to lie. You helped him out, brother. You watching this video? I don't know what they did. I don't know what they did to keep Lee batch. I don't know what they did to his batch. They ain't put no love in his shit. They put love in my shit. Yeah, this is busting. <laughs> this is a hitter. If I come and do Orlando again, nobody gonna eat this shit again. And that's no cap. As long as they make it like this, fries crispy, seasoned up real nice. In the motherfucker. Mm-hmm. I get these hoes a nine out of ten. And that's no guy. So I'm in the car thanking you guys. And Keith Lee's did not look like this at all. So I'm thinking what it is. I feel like it's the heat level he selected. He probably got like mild or something like that. So they didn't put the seasoning on the on the meat. Because bro, this this is on a season up real nice. I can't recall his looking like this, bro. Like, there's a whole lot of seasoning. If you go here, bro, make sure you get the medium and up. Like, do not get mild, none of them sensitive heats. You go, you're going to have to get the one that's actually seasoned. You know what I mean? Because, like, well, crispy, crunchy. It's just hidden. I like it. A lot of seasoning. Look, seasoning even on the pickle. 